Welcome to everybody in our virtual audience. Thank you for joining us on Number One Daughter, Who Said We're the Responsible Ones? Margaret and Iron Brooker. All the way from North Carolina, Omi Shade. Say hello to Kathy in Arizona. Ooh, Arizona. Both in Los Angeles, Mimi and Melanie. I would love to introduce you to Karen Chong at AARP. When you're a number one daughter, you just are the one who takes charge. And it's so Gen X, the scrappy DIY. Let's just yeah. do it. Let's get it done. But we don't often make space for ourselves to really acknowledge that. It's yeah. a remarkable caregiving journey that we're on. It is allowing me to see my mother again in a whole different way. It's an honor to hold sacred space as people allow whole worlds to fall out of their mouths into my hands. Now having my parents actually need me has reignited the question about how am I meant to be in charge? I'm back where I started, terrified at the choices ahead, but ready to take on the challenge. But when I saw my mom, my eyes just filled with tears and I just went, I did a bad thing to your car. And she said, I forgive you. You never have to think about it again. Even when I was taking care of my mom, she always managed to take care of me. His fatherly intuition recognized we both needed one more memory that included his coaching. I needed one more memory of me making him proud. Because being a good daughter does not have to come at the expense of my authenticity or wholeness. This is the legacy I wanna leave my children. I've learned that being the responsible one and having responsibilities are clearly different. I'm gonna face my fears and get comfortable with being uncomfortable. I'm gonna do some messy and lean into being number one and responsible for me. I love the diversity of speakers and experiences. Such an amazing event and I've met so many wonderful women and I want to meet so many of the other women at the other events around the country. I love the storytelling, I love Margaret. I feel like she brings together such a great group of people and I always feel really filled up when I come to tonight. This was the most incredible, unexpected night. I can't wait to do this again.